All right, this seems to be a persistent question that a lot of you have asked. How loud is this PureWick machine supposed to be? And I am going to try to use my rechargeable battery-powered PureWick demo unit to kind of show you in an artificial environment with a microphone that is placed very close to the unit so I can demonstrate to you how loud this machine is. It's actually not very loud at all, in my opinion. And if this is down on the floor next to my bed, if I have to use this, it would be imperceptible. Now, of course, everybody's different, right? Some of us are more sensitive to noise, whereas some of us are not. For those of you who don't know me, I did a couple of videos before. My name is John Lin. I'm a urologist in Gilbert, Arizona. Although I am a urologist, I am not your urologist, so please reserve any medical questions and send them to your personal physician. I do prescribe PureWick to some of my patients, some of my ladies who are incontinent of urine. And this, this question of noise seems to come around and ask quite frequently. In my last video, I had this, I used a PureWick and I put it next to this microphone right here. But unfortunately, this microphone in the software had a noise gate, meaning it filters out low-level noise. And guess what is low-level noise? It's one of these PureWick machines. So today, I have a PureWick and a microphone set up really close to it. So this is a very artificial environment, and I am trying to show you how loud or how not so loud this is. And in my opinion, it is not very loud. So let me turn on this microphone right here. And now I'm going to turn on this battery powered PureWick and, and I'm going to turn off, I'm going to turn off this microphone so you can hear what this sounds like with a microphone that is artificially close to it. So let me turn off my microphone and turn on All right, now I'm going to turn on the uh, machine. I'm going to turn off my microphone right now. So that is what it sounds like with a microphone that is really close to it. Now, if it's really loud, it's typically a problem. I'm going to turn my I'm going to turn on my microphone so you can hear me. If it's really loud, it's usually some sort of a leak. If this is not placed properly on top of this canister, then this is what it sounds like. Let me turn off my vocal microphone and leave this microphone on. So that's with it appropriately placed and sealed nicely, and I'm going to take it off now. So, so that's loud. This is not. Now the cap is on. It's nice and quiet, but when it's off, it's loud. So if there's any sort of a leak, let me see if I... And this is, this is going to be... Let's see, let me, let me disconnect it from this end here. Okay, so if there's a leak right here, this is what it sounds like. And when it's appropriately connected with both microphones on, this is what it sounds like. It's super quiet. Now I'm going to turn off, now I'm going to turn off this microphone So you hear it from just that microphone right there, which is artificially close to, to this device. So it's actually really, really quiet. So anyway, anyway, that is how quiet is supposed to be. It is not a very loud unit. And so if there's any sort of a loud noise, you probably want to make sure that the canister is appropriately seated all the way down into the pump 
and make sure all the connections are nice and tight. So hopefully this gives you some insight into how quiet it's supposed to be with your PureWork machine. It's supposed to be very quiet. It should not really disturb your, your sleep. It's probably a little bit louder than a CPAP machine, but it's, it's not supposed to be so loud that it wakes you up. So I know everybody's a little different. Some people like a little bit of white noise to go to sleep with. Some people want absolute quiet with their eyes completely covered in complete darkness. I know some people who sleep with earplugs so they can they can avoid hearing any of this this distraction everybody's individual so try it out see what works for you but do what you can to make sure all the connections are tight to minimize any noise that could be spurious and that is not typical of this puric machine any questions or comments feel free to leave them below take care bye bye